Back here in the States to a new law in Indiana leading to outrage across the country. It's called the Religious Freedom Act, but critics say it's a free pass to discriminate against gays and lesbians. Indiana's governor standing firm and speaking out in an exclusive interview with ABC News. Here's Gio Benitez. Our state. Our state. With a firestorm brewing over Indiana's new Religious Freedom Act, the man in the middle, Governor Mike Pence, coming forward today to defend the law in an interview with our own George Stephanopoulos. We're not going to change the law, okay? But if the General Assembly in Indiana sends me a bill that adds a section and clarifies what the law really is, then I'm open to that. Pence arguing similar laws are on the books in other states, but critics say the Indiana version, signed Thursday, gives businesses a license to discriminate, allowing them to refuse services to gay couples for religious reasons, a point George asked the governor about repeatedly on ABC's This Week. Do you think it should be legal in the state of Indiana to discriminate against gays or lesbians? George. It's a yes or no question. Who's your, come on, Hoosiers don't believe in discrimination. This is about protecting the religious liberty of every Hoosier, of every faith. Country. Yes or no, should it be legal to discriminate against gays and lesbians? George, you're, you're following the mantra of the last week online, and you're trying to make this issue about something else. One fix that people have talked about is simply adding sexual orientation as a protected class under the state's civil rights laws. Will you push for that? Uh, I will not push for that. Some big names are joining the protesters on social media, from Miley Cyrus to Hillary Clinton, tweeting, sad this new Indiana law can happen in America today. Apple chief Tim Cook saying, we are deeply disappointed. It's Former NBA awesome. star awesome. Charles awesome. Barkley awesome. now calling for the NCAA to pull this week's Final Four tournament out of Indiana. Tonight, both sides of this debate showing no signs of backing down. Gio Benitez, ABC News, Indianapolis.